Today we are reading chapter 5 of the Gospel of John in our Bible reading challenge for July, in which we are seeing a plot development happening, as well as intersecting few logical blocks from the previous chapters building on top of one another. And in chapter 5, there is a miraculous healing that takes place, followed by a discourse in which Jesus explains his special relationship with God, who he calls Father, revealing his divine nature and relationship with God. But it plays out in a psychological exchange, as it were, uh, with this predominant theme and revelation of the self-interest of people, including the man that Jesus heals, who will go on to betray Jesus, as it were, um, giving us a forecast as to what will happen later on in the Gospel. And this is contrasted by Jesus' innocence and vulnerability, confirming his role as the Lamb of God, who is led, as it were, to the slaughter for and because of the sins of the whole world. And this exchange uh, is particularly uh, around the argument of the Sabbath, an expression of the law. And Jesus is pointing out to his opponents that the Sabbath is designed as an act of restoration, but they use it as a tool for judgment. And because Jesus heals on the Sabbath, it points out the very nature of, um, of why the Sabbath exists, but also his role um, and his nature as God to do this restorative work on the Sabbath. And that the Sabbath is fulfilled in Jesus and the Sabbath work is for us to actually come into a space of grace that Jesus does the work for us. And that we can actually just be in a place of gratitude and accepting and believing because of the divine nature of Jesus and the work that he does because of his love for us. And I believe that the application here is that we have to perhaps interrogate our own psychology that is a hindrance for us to believe who Jesus says he is and to accept the work that he does for our salvation and that we can come into a space where we can surrender and pour out our hearts to him and just experience uh, the eternal salvation and sabbath that he wants to give us for the work that he does and the nature and his character that is revealed so let me know what you think